Hi guys, welcome to today's video. So a couple of weeks ago I organised all of our fruit and vegetables into some glass containers with wooden lids that I've recently got from IKEA. This was just so that we could hopefully keep them fresher for longer. So after I uploaded the video to YouTube and also over on my Instagram account, I had lots of messages where people were asking whether the containers made any difference to the fruit and veg. So I thought I'd quickly let you know how I've been getting on. This video footage was taken a week after I put the fruit and vegetables into the containers. As you can see, there's not much left, but what is left is doing pretty well for one week on. Personally, the fruit and vegetables that I normally buy would definitely have gone off earlier than this. They're still looking quite fresh. The raspberries and strawberries have started to go a little bit soft, but I was expecting that, and normally this happens after just a couple of days, so I definitely think that the containers are worth getting, and I'll definitely be using them again. If you're new to my channel and you haven't seen the organisation video yet and you want to check it out, please click the link at the top of the screen. I've also put the video link in the description box below. Okay, so getting back to today's video, I'm going to add to my organisation and I've actually just bought some labels from Amazon which come with some chalk markers. They come in all different sizes which will be perfect for the different size containers that I've got. So what I'm planning to do is write on these all of the use by dates for the different fruit and vegetables just because I was conscious of the fact that I wasn't actually sure when we were needing to eat them by. I've been shopping this morning, I've got lots of fresh fruit and vegetables so I'm going to start organising again. So these labels should be perfect for this because they're really easy to peel off and then stick down onto the containers. They're also waterproof so when I come to wash up the containers they won't fall off and then I can just wipe off the chalk and then just use them again. So as you can see I'm just using the blueberries as an example, so I've written on the use by date onto the label, I'm just going to peel it off and stick it onto the container. As you can see that was really easy to do so it shouldn't take me long to do the rest of the fruit and vegetables. If you'd like to shop these labels yourself I've popped the link to them in the description box below. If you are new to my channel please remember to check out my other videos, they all relate to things around the home. If this is something you're interested in please make sure you hit the subscribe button. As well as this you can also find me over on Instagram and also TikTok. I would love to know if you've done something similar or if this has inspired you to do the same, please let me know in the comment section below. That's them all organised, it was really easy to do and now they're ready to go in the fridge. Thank you for watching, I hope you enjoyed the video, if you did please remember to give it a thumbs up and if you're new here please remember to subscribe and hit the bell button so you don't miss any future videos.